Nicole Scott here from Mobile Geeks, and here we have a, a new Intel reference design. It's running Intel's Clover Trail Plus. So this is on the Z2560 processor. So this is a dual core processor uh, clocked at uh, 2 uh, gigahertz. So here I'm running uh, Epic Citadel, so you can see that it is very graphically intensive. This is a this is a big program with big graphics. So we just take a quick little walk around here. Oh wait, that door doesn't go in. Sorry guys, walked you right into a dead end. But regardless, you can see that I'm walking around, I'm looking around, performance is great, it's really smooth. Uh, if we take a quick look at the system, you can see that on the side here, we have a micro USB port down here along the bottom. Oh no, that's the, uh, that's micro HDMI, sorry about that, because that's the cable to the TV up here where you can see that uh, my amazing gameplay, or not really gameplay, my amazing walking around is being shown. So down here on the bottom we have a uh, micro USB port, there's some speakers around there, there's our volume rocker there, uh, at the top there's a headphone jack, and then there's the power button. Around the back, well, because this is a reference design, um, the megapixels of the camera will be determined by the OEM that decides to publish or manufacture this. So if we just take a quick look at the system, you can see that it is obviously running Android. You can play some games. It is getting a little warm right up here in the top corner. I got an ultrabook. Um, yeah, it is, it is a little warm to the touch right here, which is too bad uh, as it's opening this game. Kind of, I'm an analyst. from Breaking Bad. There we go. Oh, it's a TV series. That's it. That's the drug guy? Yeah. There we go. Briefing. There we go. Guys he works with. Eventually kills. I've been drug dealer There we go. Never heard that one before. Yeah. Skip the intro. Get on in. So this one is the Clover Trail Plus? Yes. Okay. This is the only model that, you know, is produced. Uh, so there we go. I'm playing a game. Shooting that stuff. There we go. You can see that the graphics are running fairly smoothly. With one finger. No, I'm just going to get out of this game. Yeah, I was looking at, he had one too over there that I was looking at. I was just going up here to see that one over. And let me pull up the camera. Because the uh, Clover Trail Eye has uh, a lot of interesting features, like it has the the burst, so you can take multiple shots. So it'll be shipping in China for HSPA networks. Yeah. Location. Here's the mode. Uh, do you want? Do you know where the burst shot is in, in the camera? Or do yeah, I do. Have yeah. That? yeah. Could you just pull that up for me? There we go. So it's in here in multi. In multi. And then. Will you want me to take a photograph? Yes, please. So, uh, how many how many shots is that at one eight? Um, it's ten in uh, one second. Ten in one second. Sorry, I need to press this button here. No problem. Like a machine gun. Perfect. Yeah. So this has just been a quick look at the uh, Intel reference design running Clover Trail Plus. Um, obviously, the, the case and the the dual flash and everything will you know will be modified when uh, whoever decides to make this eventually brings it to market. So I'm Nicole Scott from Mobile Geeks taking a quick look at uh, what's new with Intel.